Hi everybody and welcome back to my channel. So today we are finally going to be planting some potatoes. The potatoes that I've picked are called Vivaldi and they are a second early potato um, which means that you can plant them any time after March. Now it has been really cold over the last week. I think we even had a little bit of snow. It didn't stick and it was only here for like a minute but it has been really cold but the next two weeks it's looking like the weather's going to be a bit milder we're definitely not expecting it to fall below freezing and i'm hoping that that will mean that these potatoes can then grow and won't be affected by frost i do have some fleece just in case that does happen so i will definitely be keeping an eye on the weather so they have been sat on the windowsill in my porch for quite a few weeks now and so they've grown some uh, some chits so the very first start Part of um, the sprout that comes out um, so they are definitely ready to go in and I am very much looking forward to having those later in the year so they'll take about 13 to 14 weeks which should mean they are ready in mid July and that will mean that I can follow them on with a second crop in the same space so I'm intending on once again trying some leeks um, although I probably won't need the whole of that space so what I'm probably going to do is harvest half of them, put the leeks in their place and leave the others to grow on. Because this is a potato that you can eat either as a much earlier baby potato or leave to grow on to larger tubers. So I'm basically going to split them in half and we'll hopefully have a little bit of an experiment and see if we can get bigger tubers by maybe leaving them in a little bit longer, or at least an extra maybe four weeks or so. But I'll just play it by ear and see. We'll try a few and see how it goes. So... Let's go. When you say that you're a no-dig gardener and then that you're going to plant potatoes, I think sometimes people get quite confused about what that might mean or how you might do that. There are loads of different ways to grow potatoes. And to be honest, I don't really feel like there's one that is like the right way to do it. I like to use a bulb planter and make a little bit of a hole. I pop my potato in and then I will mulch on top as my potatoes grow. I know other people that put their potatoes directly on top of the soil and mulch over it right from the beginning and they also grow just fine people also grow in pots and planters and those potatoes <laughs> grow just fine too i think what's probably more important is understanding how it is that potatoes grow because the tubers that you actually want to eat grow in the very top portion of soil they grow in the mulch that you cover the potatoes with they don't grow down into the ground like you know normal roots would do they sort of grow outwards to the side so what's really important is that you figure out what you're going to use to mulch your potatoes so that they've actually got something nutritious to grow in now there are quite a few options you could use you can use compost um, I know that sometimes it can be hard to come across enough compost to mulch potatoes so depending on where you live what your budget is that may be something that you find a bit more difficult to do but you could also use things like grass if you have access to um, grass that's not been sprayed then you can lay that out on a piece of clear polytheme with another piece on top and it'll dry it out and you can use that to mulch potatoes they grow in that just fine you can also use wood chip um, whether that's fresh wood chip or slightly composted wood chip doesn't really matter to be honest as far as I can tell potatoes don't really seem to care that much they're one of those crops that's just pretty happy with whatever you do with them um, so I think if you've not grown them before honestly give them a go but don't feel like I guess you know pressured into feeling like there's the correct way to do it do what works for you do what works with the piece of land that you have at the end of the day you'll get potatoes and honestly i have to say it is one of the best harvests it's really really good fun 
pulling potatoes um, and you never really know how many they're going to be you don't know how big they're going to be it's just a lot of fun and they are super easy to grow so definitely give it a go so thank you so much for watching this quick video today um, I hope you're all having a great day. If you're not already subscribed, please do so. Um, and definitely leave a comment below. I'd love to hear which potatoes you're growing, whether or not, you know, you love those baby potatoes. If you're looking to, you know, grow massive jacket potatoes this year, let me know below in the comments. I'd love to hear from you and take care.